I'm going to do something else for you that is really not only a classic from Sicily, but also from home. And now this is something that my grandmother always loved to do. She would just take scoops of ricotta cheese and fry them in a little butter and olive oil. And I'm going to do the same thing, but to keep it just a little neater. And you see how dry this fresh cow's milk ricotta cheese is. I'm putting it in just a little mold like this just to help keep the shape. And if you were using ricotta cheese that was not as solid as this, well, what you could do is add a piece of plastic wrap to the inside of the mold and then put the cheese inside of that, and that will help you to unmold it. Sometimes I use an ice cream scoop to mold this into a frying pan. So I'm going to just do two for you and press that down really well. And you could also add a little bit of mint or some parsley to the bottom of the mold. So there. And now, in another frying pan here with a little butter and olive oil, I'm going to add these. And in they go. There's one. And there's the other one. And that's just going to cook like that for a few minutes until they start to get a little brown. Now let me see how we're doing here. Here are our little bundles, and now you want to carefully turn them over. And they should just be slightly browned on each side, and these need to go just a little bit more, so I'm going to turn that up, turn the heat up on that. And while that's just going, take them out. There's one. And there's the other one. And that's delicious, just the way it is. Or you wanted to gussy that up a little bit. A little coarse black pepper goes over the top, as well as a drizzle of olive oil. Now tell me, that doesn't look delicious. 